Hey guys, today I did a really quick minimal makeup everyday makeup routine video. This is how I personally do my makeup on a daily basis. Like this is how I do my makeup for class, for running errands, for doing normal things. <laughs> you know, just normal things out into the everyday world. This is how I always do my makeup. Whenever I'm doing a get ready with me video, I wear a lot more makeup during that video because I like to show you guys a bunch of different products and talk to you guys about everything and just I want to be able to show you guys a million different things in a get ready with me video and I think it's way more fun if I'm showing you guys a bunch of different things so that's why there's way more makeup in those videos this is how I actually do my makeup when I'm doing everyday things and I wanted to share it with you guys because a lot of you guys have been requesting an everyday makeup routine and I'm finally doing it for you guys it's not a lot of products at all and it's super easy just recently started using this. Um, I got a Makeup Forever lipstick and a birthday present from Sephora and I found out that Emily Ratajkowski uses it as her blush and lip color so I've been super obsessed with doing that. I've been using the Makeup Forever one as of lately ever since I found out Emily Ratajkowski uses it so yeah had to let you guys know that. So I will talk to you guys when the video is done. I'm starting off with brows. This is Ico's brow liner and mine is in the shade brown. All I'm doing is filling in sparse areas and the front of my brows where they're really sparse. And um, I'm not trying to add too much definition, just making them look nice and groomed. And then to set the brows, I'm taking the L'Oreal Brow Stylus Plumper. This is a brow gel mascara, so the actual gel actually does make your eyebrows a little bit thicker and then it even has little fibers to extend the hairs in your brows, so a little bit goes a long way. And if you concentrate the fibers in the parts of your brows that are sparse, it's really nice. I'm using the Amore Pacific Tinted Moisturizer and I'm just dotting this all over my face and then blending it in with my fingers. I love this tinted moisturizer because it sets. It's not completely matte, but it doesn't stay oily or sticky, which is a problem that I had with a lot of other tinted moisturizers, but I've really been loving this one and this is the one I've been using pretty much on a daily basis. For concealer, I'm taking the NYX HD and I'm just putting this under my eyes and then the corners of my nose to brighten up the darkness under my eyes and then conceal the redness around the corners of my nose and I'm just taking my finger to uh, blend this one out. I'm taking Makeup Forever N9 and I just put this on my fingertips and then I'm applying it to my cheeks. You could actually kind of just rub the lipstick onto your cheeks and then blend it out if that's what you wanted to do, but I think it's easier if you apply it to your fingers and then blend it out on your cheeks. Um, you only need a tiny bit and it's going to give you a really nice sheer wash of color. And then for bronzer, I'm taking the 16 hour sunless bronze, this is by Too Faced, and I'm applying this with a Zoeva angled brush. I'm just lightly adding definition and contouring under my cheeks, um, I'm bronzing up my temples, and then I'm going to put a little bit on my chin and the sides of my nose, just to give a little bit of definition. I'm curling my lashes, and I use my shoe Ulimura. This is Lash Domination Mascara, it's by Bare Minerals, and I'm applying this on my top lashes only, not on the bottoms. The brush on this mascara is something else, it kind of has these interlocking spiral bristles, it's crazy, but once you get the hang of it, it does give a really nice volumizing and lengthening effect. And then for a highlight on the face, I'm taking the Bare Minerals Stroke of Light Highlighter Illuminator. This is a creamy liquid. It's not liquidy, but it's not really creamy. It's kind of in the middle. And I'm just putting this on the tops of my cheekbones, the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow, inner corner of the eyes, and under the brow bone. This gives a really beautiful twinkling highlight effect. It's not 
really illuminizing effect. It has kind of these larger flakes of shimmer in it and when those catch the light, they twinkle. It's really, really pretty, trust me. <laughs> Taking that N9 one more time, I'm just applying a sheer layer to the lips and then I'm going to blend it out with my finger. You don't need a ton. I don't really want a ton of lipstick on a daily basis, so I just put it on a little bit, blend it out with my fingers, and I'm good to go. To set everything and keep it in place, I'm using the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Set and Spray. This is going to give the makeup longevity and it's not going to slip and slide around on the face and it's going to help prevent it from breaking down. that's how I do my makeup on a daily basis and I hope you guys enjoyed as always products and information links all of that will be down below don't forget to come follow me on Twitter and Instagram I'll have both of those linked down below as well leave me some comments so that we can talk to each other and I will see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching bye guys oh and if you like this video give it a thumbs up because your thumbs up really helped me out a lot so, okay bye guys